Hi YouTube, in this tutorial I'm gonna show you how to create a 3D arrow in Photoshop. Okay, first we are going to create a new file. Uh, width to 1000, height to 1000, resolution 72, and background contents to transparent. Okay. Now, um, select custom shape tool. And in shapes, uh, select arrow. If it isn't there, just click on this arrow and select all. Click OK. And then select this arrow. Now, holding shift, drag the arrow until you're satisfied. Like this. Now, right click on the layer. Rasterize layer. Now, select move tool. Click on edit. Transform. Rotate. Hold shift. And rotate it 90 degrees. Click OK. To the center. okay. Now uh, we are going to duplicate duplicate this shape one layer for about 40 times. You just press Alt, hold it, and repeatedly press down and then left arrow until you see uh, the number 40 on the layer screen. So we are going to duplicate it. Okay. Now, merge uh, layers from shape one copy forty to shape one copy. Merge it all. Leave shape one only. Like this. Right click. Merge layers. Now, double click on shape one. Then select gradient overlay. Um. Now, on gradient. Select any colors you want. Uh, for this one, I'm gonna use light blue and dark blue. Okay. Click OK. Now scale it to 150 and select radial. Okay. Now drag shape one over the shape one, copy 40, so we can see it like this. Now you see we have this uh, 3D effect. Now double click on shape one, copy 40. Then again gradient overlay. Now select the same colors like this and here the same color this darker okay click OK again select radial scale it to 150 and click reverse okay now I select both layers by holding shift and move it to the center now I'm gonna scale it because I made it too big, so scale, hold shift. Keep in mind that you have to keep both layers selected. So, okay. Now uh, we are going to create a new layer and we are again we are again select shape one. Now using the pen tool uh, by these options, here's the second and here's the first. Select the border. the borders of shape one layer now right click make selection and no I was wrong I'm gonna undo it because I made it wrong uh, so uh, you select here 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 and here now click somewhere in the middle and drag it like this okay Select here and here. Now right click, make selection and click OK. Now uh, select layer 1 and fill the layer 1 with white. Like this. And uh, opacity to 20%. Select, select. Now we have this uh, glossy effect. Now we are going to select uh, shape 1 copy 40 but first we are going to make layer 1 and shape 1 layers invisible. Again uh, we are going to use um, pen tool with the same settings and now we select all the shape on the borders. So Now you select the whole shape. should go to the border so now create a new layer 
Select shape on copy 40. Right click, make selection. OK. Now click on layer 2. And again fill it with white. Opacity to 20%. Select, deselect. And make uh, first two layers visible again. So here's that uh, glow effect. Now double click on shape 1. And we're gonna make it some. Uh, click on stroke. You can change this color if you don't like the black. So you can change for red or something. I'm just gonna leave it black. And and shape one copy forty again. Stroke. And that's it. You have your 3D glossy arrow created. Okay. That's all. Thanks for watching and uh, goodbye.